The European Union says it is in talks with Nigeria to get its supply of gas following Russia's withdrawal of supplies to the regional body, being a fallout from the ongoing Russian-Ukraine war. The European Union ambassador to Nigeria says the EU is also interested in continuing to deepen the bilateral relations between Nigeria and the European Union. Moya Thomas reports. The EU Commission lights up the Abuja city gate to signify the strong partnership between Nigeria and the European Union. Earlier at a press briefing, the European Union head of delegation, Samuela Isopi, paid tribute to the growing bilateral relations between Nigeria and the European Union. As every year, this is also an opportunity to take stock uh, of the main uh, achievements uh, and results of our cooperation and our partnership with Nigeria. She specifically harped on the advantages this has brought to Nigeria, especially in areas of trade. That the European Union is Nigeria's most important trading partner. We are the largest trading partner for Nigeria, amounting for almost 21% of Nigeria's trade with the world. The world is big, so I don't have to tell you that uh, if we represent 21%, it's quite big. If you go back a couple of years to, to 2020, um, trade between EU and Nigeria, total trade, was actually down to 22 billion euros. So there was a, a, a big global downturn in trade. Uh, Nigeria was affected by this along with every other country in the world, uh, but it has bounced back. And it's interesting that it has bounced back in Nigeria's favor. So there's quite a big trade surplus in Nigeria's favor. The ambassador also disclosed that Nigeria has sent a request to the EU to observe the 2023 elections, which he says is part of their commitment to ensuring democratic governance and rule of law. She assures that these and many more forms of support to Nigeria will remain unwavering. Uh, I cannot provide you figures. I hope I will be able to do it next year. But uh, uh, we also are, I will not say the first, but for sure, one of the leading investors in Nigeria, uh, we are mapping out for the very first time the presence of European Union investments in Nigeria. When I say European Union investments, what I mean is joint ventures, so joint uh, cooperation. The 9th of May is a European Union Day, and the Commission says it will mark this with government officials on the day. The EU also promised to strengthen its relations in digital economy by supporting startup companies in the country. Moya Thomas, TVC News, Abuja.